Hello my friends and welcome to another Tuesday of Tutorial. I am Leonardo Perez Nieto and today we will draw with brush and ink. We will use Indian ink and oriental brush and I will dilute a little bit with water so that it is of a lighter tone. I recommend having some scrap paper to test it and some tissue paper to take the excess off. Last week I was told that my drawing was not very easy to follow, so today we will create a much simpler one. A woman sitting viewed from the back. We begin with the outline of the hair, starting with the little bun on top and then the head, like so. Then we can indicate the ears, draw the jaw inwards and the neck, very easily. Maybe that's a little bit skinny to be real, but I will leave it like that. And we do the shoulders, the right and left. We indicate the spine with a line and the arms will be coming down almost straight. I remind you that if you are interested in learning to draw with ink or if you want to refine your skills on that subject, I have a brand new course which gives you the fundamentals. Whether drawing with a brush or with a pen or a combination of both, I think you will find it interesting. And you can actually take it for free with a new membership. Check it out with the link below the video. Ok, now we give a wash to the dress with the diluted Indian ink. And we go over the hair as well, leaving some white small reflections on the upper part. Let's draw a surface for her to sit on and then why not some birds, some flying birds, so that the drawing has some meaning to it and can call upon the imagination of the public to participate and maybe make their own stories out of it. I darkened our mix to give it more intensity and also more contrast between the close-by girl and the faraway birds. And let's add even some darker touches. Very good, excelente! I love drawing with ink. Now sticking that brush in water, I create a very light one for some smooth shading. And we apply it to her back and some on the arms and neck. Don't forget to check out the How to Draw with Ink course with the link below. We give it the last touches and it's ready. If you enjoyed it, please give it a like, subscribe to Fine Art Tips if you haven't done so already, please take much care of yourself and your family, and I will see you with more art on Tuesday.